this is Alex and I'm going to be showing you how to make your web browser uh, much much safer for surfing the internet and it's uh, unbelievably simple and before I uh, show you what to do just note that uh, if you have Norton Internet Security then you probably have um, a variant of this extension that I'm about to show you but uh, since Norton's Internet Security is not entirely compatible with Google Chrome uh, what I'm about to show you can be extremely helpful if you do use Chrome. So I go and go ahead and open up Google Chrome, and I'm not entirely sure if they make it for any other browsers, to be honest. But um, you're gonna want to go to uh, uh, you're gonna want to go to uh, Chrome.Google.com/extensions, and in the search bar, go ahead and type in W O T and it'll be the first one it's called a web of trust and uh, it's this it's the one with the green ring and it's a verified author which means uh, Google says it's safe to use and uh, you want to install that I'm not gonna click install because I already have it and uh, I'm gonna go back to Google here and after you have downloaded web of trust or WOT you want to uh, <clears throat> or I'll just show you say you're on google.com and you've searched something I'm going to type in oops, torrent sweet Jesus alright <clears throat> and now you'll see all these green circles they may not be green but green means it's a safe website to use and you can only get this if you have a web of trust now it's a, if it's an unsafe site it'll have either a yellow or a red ring depending on how bad the uh, the website's reputation is I'm going to try and find you a good example um, sorry I'm typing with one hand here antivirus ah, there we go <laughs> And you'll see that there are plenty of websites that have these wet, or uh, excuse me, red and yellow rings. And what this means is they are unsafe sites to use. And it may mean that uh, they have uh, downloads on that page that you can uh, download, and they'll infect your computer with malware and such. But uh, it may also mean that even if you open their web page, you'll be infected, and even if you don't click anything on that web page and um, that's pretty much it it's very easy to use and uh, if you hover by the way this uh, this works on any website even if you're not on Google and um, the website you're currently on you can check the rating for as well and uh, right here it's uh, it says it's safe to use and uh, uh, what else is I going to show you and if I click on one of these sites with a red ring, it should. Um, yes, yeah, see, it warns me that this site has a poor reputation. And uh, you can say that this site is, in fact, safe and you want to rate it otherwise. Or you can say ignore warning and go to the site. Or you can say view rating details and comments. And I'm going to hit that. And it'll take you to their website where it shows what they call the scorecard for, uh, this, for the website that you uh, were just on see this website has a poor reputation trustworthiness vendor reliability that's uh, who owns the rights to the website privacy and child safety all of them have extremely low ratings and uh, this is out of 100 mind you and this is 7767 and uh, comments by category they have uh, nine comments on this page related to uh, phishing which is um, you know stealing credit cards stuff like that Malicious content like viruses and ethical issues like um, like uh, legal problems. And I'm gonna go now. I'm gonna cut this video off, and uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Please uh, rate, comment, subscribe, and um, I'll tickle your scrotums if you do.